So this is an S7400 PLC and it is in the stop mode as evident from its LEDs. Both the communication processor and the CPU uh, 4163 dB both are in the stop mode. Well, if I uh, change the dip switch position from run to stop and then to run again, there is no change on the mode of the PLC CPU that is it is in the stop mode even after changing the switch position I am going to switch off the power to the CPU and CPU modules and I switch on the power again well still it's not getting out of the stop mode and it is in the run mode this is a fault condition of the CPU 4163DP, a 7400 Simmons PLC. And you can look at the other modules, they all are in the fault mode, right? You can see the red LEDs on each module. And these are the error LEDs, and this is the third rack. So, this fault position actually means that the program in the memory of this uh, CPU is no more running, right? The processor is not scanning the program and uh, this is why it is in the stop mode and uh, no equipment in the field can be operated in this position, right? So the solution to this problem is we have to re-download the program from the engineering station to this uh, CPU memory card, right? I have to re-download the entire configuration, that is the hardware configuration, that is the logic and the network configuration. All these three configurations need to be downloaded into this CPU, right? And this stop mode, since it is not getting at the stop mode, the CPU is not getting out of the stop mode, that means that uh, the program has been washed, right? So let's go to the engineering station and re-download the entire program. Well, since the PLC program has been washed, as I told you, the corresponding area on the HMI, that is the coal mill, looks like this, right? We cannot access anything we cannot operate and we cannot monitor any sensor value right so to solve the issue I'm going to the engineering station well this is the engineering station of our plant DCS every single configuration has been made in this engineering station I will go to the plant component view and I will click on the coal project. I will go to the hardware configuration on the coal PLC. This is how it looks like. Well, before going to the hardware configuration, let me take you to, take you to the logic of the coal PLC, the CFC logic. Here, if I try to go online, well, it will take me online, but it will show me that the PLC is not processing the program, right? And the PLC is in the stop mode. It will take a bit time because, well, the PLC could not be linked online. I'm trying to do that. Okay, so let me download the entire configuration or the hardware configuration. In first place, I will download the hardware configuration. This is the SOP of re-downloading the entire configuration to a specific S7400 PLC. 
in the semantic manager. Do you want to start the module now? Well, I'm going to start the module. You have to be patient in this fault scenario because since the PLC is in the stop mode, uh, uh, that is an abnormal situation. So there may come some delay in the process of downloading the hardware logic and network configuration to the PLC. the hardware configuration has been downloaded now i will go to the logic the cfc logic of the plc this is the coal mill plc cfc logic first i well, this is the cfc logic of the specific coal mill plc i will click on this download icon i will select the entire program the blocks and the CPU will be deleted, please note. Well, it means that whatever we have now in this specific PLC will be deleted and will be replaced with this entire configuration. I will go with the OK. Now, this will take some time. Let me pause the video and get to you back as soon as the download to the CPU, the entire program downloading to the CPU is completed. Well, the complete download to the PLC has been completed. Right, I close this. If I look at the HMI of the coal mill, still it indicates that the PLC is in the stop mode. Right, I will need to perform another download. Right, and that is the network configuration because the PLC is in the network as well, it's not an isolated PLC. So, I will go to the hardware configuration, I will click on this icon of the network and this is the coal mill plc in the network right what i will do download the selected station i will click on this yes the network configuration is being downloaded to the specific plc which we want to fix that is we want to take it out of the stop mode into the run mode because we have to operate the plant that is a critical step that is to take the plc out of the run uh, out of the stop mode into the run mode do you want to start the module now complete restart yes Well, while it is being switch, switched to the run mode, I will focus my camera on the HMI and so that you can observe how the HMI looks like when the PLC is in the run mode. It is going to take some time. Please be patient. Well, the PLC has been switched to the run mode and the program that we downloaded to the specific PLC is now being operated by the processor of the PLC, right? So if I take you back to the PLC module, all the LEDs will be normal, that is the run LEDs will be lit and now we can operate various equipments 
in the plant in the Colmir area and we can monitor all the sensors values as well. So this is the procedure of how to fix this issue. If you have any query you can please ask me in the comment section. Thank you.